What's up guys, this is Levi and I am from Shred Shop and we are gonna talk about the Patagonia Black Hole Pack. Not to be confused for their Brown Hole Pack. Make sure guys, if you want this as a gift and you're showing it to someone, make sure you let them know that you like it in the black because they might ask you, do you like it in the black one or do you like it in the brown? So first thing you're gonna notice about this back pack is the material that's on the outside. It is a heavy duty polyester ripstop material with uh, DWR coating all around it, which makes it water resistant, not waterproof uh, because the zippers aren't taped, none of the seams are taped, and the back up here uh, isn't water repellent, but it's a great backpack if you're walking around uh, in the light snow or in the rain, uh, not heavy duty rain, and yeah, it's a good riding backpack. So. so another thing about this outer fabric, it is Blue Sign approved, which is basically, it's a, a company in Switzerland that goes and it approves fabrics by some of the stuff they're looking at is the chemicals that are going into it is are they environmentally friendly the factories that are making this fabric are they paying their workers well are they taking care of people is it is it not a great impact on the environment those types of things there's a lot of other brands that go to the extent to make sure things are blue seal approved because that little mark blue seal approved lets us know that okay this is like high end and they've done their due diligence as far as making it safe for the environment and good from start to finish so uh, so one thing cool that's cool to check out is the way the zipper's done at the top. It zips around and it dumps the whole thing wide open, making it really easy to pack your black hole. And you can, uh, basically it's got a ton of extra little pockets that are in there. Uh, it fits a 15 inch laptop, lots of cool stuff. This is just to make it look sexy, it's just an airbag. Um, but yeah, cool zipper, really easy to access everything and lots of little details to make sure your stuff's not falling and just chilling at the bottom of the bag. So the other thing to flip it around, Check it out. Uh, this is the backside where you'd wear up against your back. Um, there is a ton of really good uh, soft padding on there. It's really breathable, making it for less sweating, that type of thing. But it's also good for, we've all packed our backpacks so full of junk that there's been that sharp thing that's sticking out on your back. That's not gonna happen here. And uh, these really sezzy contoured straps are gonna sit comfortably on your shoulders and they're gonna be nice. Guys, thanks so much for watching. This is Levi, I am from Shred Shop. Comment below with things or ways that you would pack your 25 liter black hole. And uh, yeah, have a good one. See you guys later, peace. <laughs>We just finished drinking all this eggnog. We did this dumb thing that one of our friends does called a nog jog. And we, you have to drink two liters of eggnog and then run a kilometer. So we did that and I tried to make myself throw up as much as I could to get rid of the stuff out of my stomach, but it didn't work. Then I went back to my house and I was watching a movie with this girl and we were seriously watching the movie Fury. So there's lots of war scenes and stuff like that. And then we went and I like was like, I'm just gonna, I'll go get you a glass of water. And I got her some water and then I went upstairs to my bathroom upstairs and seriously had so much diarrhea and the loudest poop that I've had in an entire year. And so I just had to wait. The, the thing is, there's no fan in that upstairs bathroom and the vent from that bathroom goes directly down above where the TV was. So I had to wait for war scenes to go on for me. So seriously, like in Fury, it'd be like blah, 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 blah. And at that point, that's when I would be and just farting my brains out. And I flushed, I think, six times to also cover up the fart noises. And the girl never noticed. So got away scot-free. But then I told the story in front of her the next day. And she found out how many times I farted and diarrhea.